Man. Three goals in his last three games. Will he be hard to stop again? Stay with us on EA TV. Excitement and anticipation ahead of kickoff time. Here we are at the Estadio de Montelivi. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And with the Spanish league season about to reach its conclusion, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It is Girona facing Celta Vigo. Well, what a season it's been, Derek. We've seen everything. Drama at both ends of the table, some spectacular goals and plenty of entertainment. The players, of course, will be... Could be! Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. And the starting 11 for Girona. Daly Blint plays with Juan Pei in central defence and a formidable striker in this setup in the person of Christian Stuani. Bamba, just the challenge that was required. And with that, the move comes to an end and a goal kick to follow now. Well, sometimes we have a fierce relegation battle, sometimes not at all. And barring a miracle over the run-in, it looks pretty clear-cut in terms of who's going down now, Stuart. Well, unfortunately, Derek, the table doesn't lie. The teams in the relegation zone just haven't been good enough. It's as simple as that. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from oh, him, Oh, can he Stuart? finish it here, Derek? Nicely saved. Well, what a chance that was to take the lead. But you have to give the goalkeeper credit. What a brilliant save that was. Well, not out of the woods just yet. This still could be dangerous. And defensive play to be applauded. Struggling to hold on to the ball. He continues his run. Can he give them the advantage? And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? So underway again here, one nil the score. Right, time for us to send it over to Alex because I believe there's been a goal in the Mallorca game. It's a goal for Real Sociedad. It's now one nil with 15 minutes played. Cheers, Alex. Oh, last ditch defending at its very finest. And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. Christian Estuani. No high quality defending. Luca Della Torre. Sanchez I do well that's common sense refereeing to play advantage Duvicas well they're moving it around with real purpose here can they square the game and keeping it out Garcia
Fran Beltran. Still possibilities. Well, they can keep possession now. Right, let's join Alex Scott for an update because, Alex, a goal has gone in in the Mallorca match. It's a goal for Mallorca. The score's level again now at 1-1 with 25 minutes played. Thanks, as always, Alex. Manu Sanchez. It did look on for them, but not to be. Making progress. Could be. Really committed defending. And this pressing approach is inducing a bit of panic. Opportunity here. It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident. And not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. the challenge that was required Jürgen Strand Larsen oh that surely had to go in but marvellous defending Can he deliver it with accuracy? Half-hearted clearance. What a commitment to defending. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? And he's fired over the corner. But he couldn't quite keep the header down. Goal kick. Garcia. Right, so I believe there's been a change to the scoreline at the Bernabeu with confirmation. Here's Alex Scott. Yeah, it's another goal for Real Madrid. They're back in this now with 37 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. Good challenge and a throw-in coming up. And they're making a change. Arnau Martinez. Chance to finish. Ball is loose. Well, that's a sad end to the attack. Bamba. A very good tackle. And getting the ball forward. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Perez. Kevin. And they have possession again. Luca Della Torre. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. 
This attack looks highly promising. Must be. In it goes. He's made it a brace for himself. No one's stopping him, apparently. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender and creates space for himself. And it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Bamba. And the referee brings this first half to an end. It's now in the history books here in Catalonia. Whatever way you slice it, it really has been a positive contribution from midfield, Stuart. Well, what a midfield performance this has been. He's been clever on the ball, he's worked hard out of possession, and he's dictated the flow of the game. Absolutely brilliant. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Good tackle. And they know they need to stop him. And the attack coming to nothing. Martinez Solis Garcia with it and Celta have it back now well play stopped it is a free kick Making sure nothing untoward happened. And continues his run. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Good idea. And not a great challenge. Free kick here. Disappointing pass. Valeri. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. Can he put it away? And the keeper more than equal to it. comes and well, the danger is still there Herrera Solis and now Garcia real chance goalkeeping of the highest order well he's got to be pleased with that save it's absolutely magnificent And over comes the corner. The clearance wasn't decisive. That is how to keep it out of the net. Nicely timed tackle. Iago Aspas. Kevin. Iago Aspas.
And well positioned to clear. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Pamba. And a fine cross. Oh, the header needed to be a lot better than that. Didn't really make the keeper work. And goal news to bring you from the Estadio Benito via Marine. Let's join Alex Scott. It's a goal for Real Betis. It was an early cross which found him in acres of space. And it was a beautiful headed finish. They've pulled one back and now trail by one with 67 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. Delivering it. And just a bit too much height on the header. Not putting so much effort into winning back possession. He continues his run, but they took care of the situation defensively. Just 20 minutes remaining now. De La Torre. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Dovbik. Garcia with it. And teammates around him. Must be. And fired against the crossbar. Goal kick it'll be. So making the substitution now. News coming through of a goal in the Mallorca game. Let's send it over, as always, to Alex Scott. It's another goal for Real Sociedad. They've pulled one back with 76 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Luca De La Torre. Jürgen Strand Larsen. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Bamba. Crossed into the penalty area. Well, nothing untoward happened. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Alex Garcia. Valeri and now Garcia well this could really help the cause is this the moment oh that is a superb save quite the catalogue of great saves and that the latest one OK, just hearing someone has scored at the Bernabeu but who exactly let's find out from Alex yeah, it's another goal for Real Madrid. They're back in this now with 83 minutes on the clock. Alex keeping us right up to date. And a throw in for Celta. And a substitution in the offing. Cross played over, but no one can latch onto the ball. Committed challenge. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Dogbeek. Read it well. But 
Well, he took care of it defensively. Iago Aspas. Perez. And space to attack. And a useful cross. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. And Stewart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.